A number of years ago, we were just talking about diversity issues, and John Rogers brought up the entire way people talk about business diversity is just all wrong. It's so incomplete that something needs to happen around the issue of, of professional services. And really, it was that moment when you see the right idea, it totally shifts the, the way you think about things. This program began with a very specific goal of looking at professional services and saying we are not doing enough. When we make investments in an institution, then we expect them to give back to the community and to be fair and to be inclusive, that they pay attention to what the University of Chicago has shown can be done in a space of five years. This has been a welcoming, opening um, environment uh, for minority businesses and so hats off to the organization for doing something like this. We've been invited to participate in many different supplier diversity programs. I can tell you head and shoulders above this program is a dramatic departure than anything else that we have seen. Well this is our fifth year hosting the Professional Services Symposium. We first hold a pre-symposium meeting where our vice presidents talk about what their specific needs are now and what they may be looking to in the future. Today's sort of warm-up, if you will, of what we should be thinking about and what we should uh, be preparing for tomorrow, I think is a fantastic thing. So we were able to take that information uh, back to our firm and speak and then recraft our message to make sure that we were hitting the points that they wanted to hear to make the most beneficial time of our presentation. The networking reception provides an opportunity for our businesses to build relationships in a more relaxed environment. And that's something that made this symposium very different is the opportunity to hear about and meet some people from other parts of the university. And really talk in a bit more detail and perhaps in just in a more relaxed way about some of the challenges and, and kind of draw that out a bit. I'm encouraged just, um, you know, seeing the other managers, seeing the commitment, seeing the commitment of the governor of the state coming here, the president of the university. We had a very nice chat with him for quite a while. The following day, we hold business presentations that give the firms an opportunity to meet one-on-one -on -one with our vice presidents and other university senior leaders. It really does make a difference. Um, it, it's really interesting for us to be able to come in and have this opportunity to have a room of eight people, and it does include the decision makers right up to the very top. So we really have a top-down commitment. President Zimmer is very committed to diversity on every level, and we have a trustee, John Rogers, who has been equally supportive of our efforts, as well as Nim Chanaya. He comes out, he knows all the firms that, that we have met with. And it really does create this opportunity for us to be the national model and something that hopefully as the years go on, we'll start to see more and more institutions following the footsteps of the University of Chicago and the extraordinary leadership that's been shown here. During our one-on-one -on -one session last year, there was an observer in our meeting that was looking to learn from you. So I hope they and, and other institutions follow in your footsteps. If you don't have a marketing machine, it's very difficult to get the audience. So the fact that we're giving them the audience I think is great, and then the fact that they're living up to those expectations has just really been stupendous. The benefit of having a business diversity symposium is that we get introduced to people that we might not ordinarily meet. Without this symposium, my firm would not have had the opportunity to serve as sole underwriter's counsel on the university's recent financing. We're trying to build a roster of a number of great firms that can do work for the university. So. We're always out looking for folks, um, yeah, and it's grown every year and for a good reason. It's, it's as rewarding to us as we think it is to the firms we work with.